Microsoft Surface Laptop Go. I believe it's a 10th generation with 128 gigabytes. Yeah. Um, it is, yeah, it is 10th generation. i5 processor and 128 gigabytes, so. That's the specs. <laughs> Joni got hers at the store. She picked it up at the store, but I had to get mine shipped because I went to a different Best Buy than her. So it just came, I think, yesterday. in a huge box so it looks taking it out of the box it has like a nice little the drawers come like this yeah like a little white plastic wrap over it we got the um rose gold pink color or i think it's called like sandy shore or something like that okay yeah it's cute. It was the most girly color that we could look for or find. Oh yeah, it's called sandstone. It kind of reminds me of the iPhone box. Yeah, box. just without the like the little texture that we had. When we first open it, this is what we have. We have the laptop right here, and you can literally just pick it up like this. Ooh, it's really light. Way lighter than what I expected it to be. Did you expect it to be heavier? I don't know. It just kind of feels like three phones. <laughs> and then when we open it right here, this will be C. So in this box, we just have a pamphlet of all the specs and everything that you need to know about this laptop. This box here, I'm gonna just pull. Ooh, it's way heavier. Probably the charger, I'm guessing. Yeah. This is definitely the power cord. It's kind of hard to just push it out though. Just to take That's it probably out. why it was hard for me to get mine back in. Mm. Yeah, it's definitely hard to take this type of stuff out. It's like you don't want to yank on the cords because this looks like this can be the only one. <laughs> but, oh, I see. What? I think you're just supposed to take just slide them in and out like this. Oh, okay. This is how the charger part looks like. Really, this is like my first time seeing my charger like this besides that. <laughs> oh yeah. It's very updated, as you yeah. guys can tell. There's no other power cord. I think only the Microsoft ones have this type of charge. I'm not 100% sure though. This power cord is 39 watt. Should charge up fast, I'm guessing. Now the moment you guys probably really want to see is the actual laptop. So we're going to remove the little silicone wrap that it has. Whatever wrap you want to call this. Ooh, I like this. So guys, I already opened up mine. So that's probably why you guys are like, why is hers so different to get open? But I already opened up mine. Okay, that's some fancy stuff. So it, it has a very smooth, like almost you can drop it texture. <laughs> I'm scared, I need a good case. That's definitely the case. So it's like booting up right now. You guys can see that. And you guys can see all the reflection. It's so clean looking. But yeah, it's booting up right now. She just unlocked her stuff with her finger. Yeah, so like I said, I already set up mine because I had you know, mine's before Naomi's. And this is the part where you can, this is like a fingerprint. And I did not know this thing came with a fingerprint until we actually set it up. I'm like, where am I gonna, like, what am I gonna touch to do the fingerprint? <laughs> and it was like, put your hand in a power cord. And I was like, well, okay, and now I see that it's like a little different. Mm. So, That's cool. It is cool. Ooh, I like this 
mouth to leave in the nostril smooth. This this whole thing just reminds me of smooth. Yeah. It's, it's super just, smooth. It's like you gotta get a case. Like yeah. Something you can't just be throwing this in your backpack. I feel like it's gonna get scratched up immediately. Yeah. Definitely have to get a case like you will a phone. How much did this cost? Do you remember? This was six ninety five after tax. So about I wanna say it was about six fifty before tax. Mm -hmm. So right now they're asking me to continue in the selected language. I mean guys, this is has probably I don't know, the same I don't even know. I think it is touch screen, isn't it touch screen? Yeah. Hi there. I'm Cortana, and I'm here to help. A little sign in here, a touch of Wi-Fi there, and we'll have your PC ready for all you plan to do. <laughs> Use your voice or the keyboard along the way, and if you'd like me to stay quiet, just select the little microphone icon towards the bottom of your screen. If you need an assistive screen reader, press the Windows, Control, and Enter keys at the same time to turn yeah, on their This is how the camera looks, okay, if you guys care. Let's dig in. Sorry about our bougie setup. Well, our bootleg setup. <laughs> <laughs> it looks, um, if you guys want to see me in it, just to kind of see how it looks. Can I see? Kind of. You probably will have to take a picture and then show. Okay, I'm going to take a picture. This, it's not the best, but it's not the worst either. I've seen way worse cameras. That's how it came out. It, it's clear. You can definitely like zoom on here at Skype and they'll see you clearly. Yeah. Um, we had a Chromebook for like about three, four Chromebook, years. Yeah. And that camera on there is not meant for zoom or any type of camera. No. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so outdated, but this one definitely is an upgrade for us, especially. Um, I'm pretty excited about that. I am too. <laughs> I love the color. It's so high tech and it's just so kind of like modern, you know? Yeah, yeah. definitely is an upgrade. So, yeah. Some, something that's necessary, <laughs> especially for school. I feel like it's easy access for school typing. It just makes me want to work, you know? Maybe you want to do some homework now. <laughs> <laughs> this is where the power cord goes in, right here. Um, They do have one USB. What's this? What would this be, you think? USB probably, is that for her? I have no clue. All right, so guys, we, we don't, we're not really high techie when it comes to knowing about all these types of things. But, oh, number five is USB-C. Okay. We don't know what a USB-C is, but that's what this is. And then obviously the headphone. So like we said, the, um, there is a fingerprint touch to sign in, right, right on the power here. button. Pretty <laughs> much your basic laptop. I mean, it's nothing really special to it to just have the basic functions aside from the um, power button being fingerprint, touch screen scan, whatever. I mean, it's literally a basic laptop. I mean, obviously, it looks more modernized. Like it's pretty. It has a nice color, nice feel. You know, but it almost looks like like a um, Apple Apple laptop. It really does to me as well. So, but it's a um, Microsoft. Yes, yeah, Microsoft. You guys, not sure if we did that. So, like I said, it has a front-facing camera. The finger power button is. I mean, the power button is the fingerprint. Um, they have. Lots of ports that you connect, and they also have a headphone jack if you need it. So really, those are like the main specs of this laptop. Nothing too fancy, because normally we don't. We probably wouldn't use all those types of functions. We normally don't edit too much. Like the basic functions is all we need really to be successful <laughs> with everything. So I mean, yeah. So I think it'll be perfect for us. Slimness, so slim. I love that it's super slim. Way different than our um way different than our phones yeah it's um i mean, I mean than our chromebook <laughs> oh yeah our chromebook but the phones is literally almost even it's about the same thickness of the phone just a little bit more thicker i mean 
It's pretty slim. Yeah. And it comes up nice picture as you guys heard Naomi's. The sound was good, really um, clear. I'm gonna call it back. I'm gonna do it with her all right guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified whenever we post. Don't forget to stay tuned for our next video. Bye.